All right, so we're gonna head to Costco. Darren and I are gonna go for a grocery haul. I'm gonna show you guys what I usually buy for groceries. The entire set, the fruits, the produce, the meat, and you guys gonna see how I eat. Let's go. All right, guys, so right now I'm on a cutting phase. I'm gonna drop a little more body fat right now. So therefore, I gotta really, really watch out for my diet. I'm trying to eat clean. So by clean, uh, for me, it means I'm trying to eat more whole foods. So I'm trying to eat real, more real food, less processed, put a little bit of caloric deficit. You know, so therefore, I need to drop some weight slowly. But when everybody, when you're trying to lose some weight, guys, remember not to drop too fast. I try to diet. I'm always trying to go high protein, but high protein, real food, real meat, and at the same time, put a little bit of caloric deficit. And then I start playing around with my fat and my carbs. Uh, I let that play out. Uh, predominantly, my preference, I, I like to uh, go with the lower fat percentage. I usually set my, my fat percentage is around 20 to 25%. Alright, we're here. Uh, let's get some food and can't forget these guys. Ooh, my absolutely favorite bread, I will call the miracle bread. These are super low calories. Make sure you tons of these. Chinese people will call food with pot, so buy this from Chinese people. Uh, it's usually better, but I'm lazy, so I stick with these guys. I used to do broccoli a lot, and I started disliking it, so I'm switching. Cauliflower, just as good. Now, the main thing. If you're on a cut, one, you got arugula, I got my baby spinach, I got my spray mix. These guys are gonna help you with cut. You need your salad when you're cutting, remember that. Mushrooms, super fibrous, low calories, easy to fill you up, very satiating. Last but not least, these guys are awesome. Try to add some colors to your veggies. Right? Well, this is probably my new favorite fruit right now. Almost like a superfood. And I'll have probably one a day. If you're looking for fat loss, get blueberries. Any kind of berries, they're probably one of the best fat loss fruits you can have on a diet. So, Lean ground beef is a very good alternative if you want to have beef steak. It's cheaper, very low fat. My new staple every other day, just for cutting. Every single, every week, I'll get two, three kilos of this. So I don't eat it every day, I eat it every other day. But this is the leanest thing you can get, easiest thing to cook. So, these are really good. So these guys have only about 0.5% fat in this. Super high protein, really good. Add that in with a salad. I do pork ones. I'm too lazy to get regular eggs. Uh, I know a lot of people like the fresh ones organics, but this is just out of convenience. I try to go find it. <laughs> I asked the staff, I'm like, where's the kimchi? She's like, eh, it's not that good here. <laughs> so she's like, I don't really want to get it again. I've been eating this already. I thought it was all right. Uh, but you know, I eat this because there's a lot of probiotics. I have something called irritable bowel syndrome. So I, have a, I go through trying to go for a FODMAP diet. So the probiotics in this kimchi actually help my, my gut health, which is very important. So there's a lot of food that I cannot eat. But for whatever reason, I'm eating this right now. It's helping my, my stomach. I'm passing gas normally. I'm going to wash normally. So, I don't recommend to everybody because it's really, really high sodium, but if it's helping my body, I go for it. So everyone's a little different, so try different things out, it actually might help you too. <laughs> no. Access denied.
Access denied. It's very sad. This is my new favorite snack of all time. Most Asian people, most Chinese people don't eat this, including the one who's holding the camera right now. <laughs> uh, but it's crazy high. <laughs> it's crazy, crazy high on protein, and it's very satiating. So I even have my bread. I even have a nighttime. So I, I don't want to feel hungry when I go home and just sleep. I want to feel full when I sleep. Wake up in the morning, have lots of food in my stomach, passion food, and then I have energy to work out. These are my go-to bars right now. We got 90 calories only. But it's a yogurt bar, very high in protein. So if I have the munchies, I have a sweet tooth, so I, I love eating sweets. So when I'm having cheese, guys, I'll have one. 100 calories, sorry, 90 calories, very easy. Super yummy, it tastes like, it tastes better than regular ice cream. Must have sexy thing right here. Don't you feel young when you're using this? All right. Do you remember the time when you were small and your mom's carrying one of these things? You're like, no, mom, I don't want this. Guess what? I'm at this age. I love it right now. <laughs> so this looks awesome. <laughs> All right, guys. So that takes us to the end of our grocery shopping. As you can see through right here, um, that's my protein, and then a good portion of this right here. That's my vegetables. So what am I diet? When you're on a diet, try to eat the low calories, but what are you gonna to use to fuel yourself and to make yourself feel full? Salad, tons of vegetable, and very lean meat, all right? So a lot of these things are very easy to make. If you want to see how I make these things, let me know. I'll definitely put these guys in a separate video. But remember, keep things simple, and make your diet simple, that's how you're gonna have success with your own diet. All right, good luck to you guys. And now, Darren and I are gonna head out to a nice workout. See you guys next time.